So you want to upgrade your hot rod with Vortec heads. Well, there's a couple of downsides you should know about. Okay, so let me get this off my chest and start off by saying Vortec heads are great. I'm not going to be hating on them too much on this video. But before I go into all the benefits of these guys, I, I really want to show you guys what the downsides of putting a Vortec head on your uh, standard small block Chevy could be. So the first big disadvantage, these are going to bolt right up to your block as usual. Nothing changes there. Uh, the big change is the intake manifold. That's going to have to go. You're going to have to get a new one. These use a totally different bolt pattern. They use a vertical bolt pattern instead of the angled bolt pattern like the normal Chevys have. And uh, that intake manifold can range anywhere between a couple hundred dollars or however much you want to spend on them. You can go crazy with it, really. The other disadvantage here, valve covers. Those guys got to go, too. You're going to have to replace them with center bolt valve covers, and you can find those in all shapes and sizes, prices as well. So not a big deal, but another thing you have to price in when you're buying these heads. All right, so the big disadvantage on these Vortec heads, that's the valve spring. These guys come stock with a .45 inch maximum lift and that's not a very big camshaft. Uh, for our street use, that's totally fine. A lot of guys are gonna to be totally fine running that. Your camshaft's not gonna be close to that. Just a nice mild cam would be perfect for that. However, if you're looking for anything larger than that, you're gonna to have to upgrade these valve springs. Now, you can go and upgrade them with Beehive valve springs. That's probably the most popular thing to do, and that can get you over half inch lift on your, um, on your camshaft here on your valves. However, if you want to get serious with it, you're going to have to go in there with a valve cutting guide and cut down the valve seat so you can actually fit a better spring on them. That's just the way they're designed. Uh, you guys can look up, there's tons of videos of how guys can do this. You can actually buy a kit and uh, you can cut it yourself at home if you're daring. So really that's all the disadvantages there are to these Vortec heads. Now let me go over some of the advantages here and tell you why you really should be considering one of these for your hot rod. So one of the biggest advantages guys love about these Vortec heads are the combustion chamber. These guys run a 64cc combustion chamber stock. So that's a big upgrade from your old 72cc or even worse combustion chamber from those old heads. Another big advantage for these Vortec heads are the airflow. These guys flow a lot of air for stock heads, one of the best you can buy. I believe they're rated around 170cc, so that's a big uh, upgrade for a lot of the old Chevy heads. Okay, so the biggest advantage of these Vortec heads, guys, it's the price. For a 64cc chamber head and how great they flow, these things are pretty dang cheap. You can find them on Craigslist, you can find them on eBay all day long, uh, used or remanufactured, anything like that. Look online, guys, I bet you guys can find a good deal on them. Okay, so one big tip here, guys, if you're looking to uh, buy Vortec heads, especially in the aftermarket, uh, make sure you're looking at the casting numbers inside the head here. There are different center bolt heads out there that don't flow anywhere near or are as near as good as these Vortec heads. Uh, what you want to look for are the last three digits on the casting number inside the head here. You want to see either 062 or 906. Those are the two types of Vortec heads you want to see. Those have 64cc chambers, all the good stuff. Uh, if it doesn't say that, don't get tricked. Okay, so that's all the advantages and disadvantages I can think of for these Vortec heads. If you guys are looking to upgrade your engine on a budget here, these guys are great. Uh, they'll upgrade your compression ratio, your flow most likely, and uh, they'll really make you happy. I can't recommend them enough. So if you guys uh, like this video, go ahead and subscribe if you want to see some more. Uh, thanks for watching though, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Got? What do you got? What do you have? Are you supposed to have that? Bro. Brody. Hey, you come back here. <laughs> Brody.